show on boxing sisters here with Juan, baby boy this. Juan, man, you see you sparring, getting ready for your upcoming fight. Tell us a little bit about your opponent, man, and how many rounds you going? Well, first of all, man, it's good to see you, Sean. It's uh, been a little minute, man. Probably been busy uh, checking out all the other Houston fighters around town, huh? But uh, no, I'm, I'm on uh, vacation, actually. Yeah, I'm in it, Disney World. All right, that's awesome, man. <laughs> that's a way to end, finish the summer, but. Uh, I'm very excited uh, to be uh, going back to Laredo again. I went to the press conference down there about a month ago. The fans are happy, they're excited, and uh, I'm excited. You know, and, uh, but the guy I'm fighting, uh, his name is Carlos Cardenas from Venezuela. I fought uh, a couple of Venezuelans in the past. Uh, the guys are, what can I say, man? They're, they're tough. And the toughest nails, they, they come forward and uh, they can punch. So, you know, this is going to be a uh, another uh, stepping stone for myself to go in there and uh, look good and uh, hopefully uh, fight some bigger fights uh, by the end of this year. All right, now sparring, you were looking really sharp in there, man. And they tell me the guy's name, your sparring name was said, man. He looks pretty impressive, man. What can you tell me about your sparring partner? That's right. Uh, you know, Highland Williams, we call him uh, Little Said. Mm -hmm. I've been, uh, we started together back in, uh, with Savannah. Yeah. You know, I, uh, I'm a little older than he is, so, mm -hmm. you know, I saw him grow up. I saw him uh, develop uh, from a uh, little boy to a, uh, to a teenager and, and a man. You know, and, and now he's uh, 17 and 1. Uh, I always said that uh, him, uh, Little Sid, and uh, Lenar Lane were going to be uh, one of the top prospects in, in the sport. You know, but there was one condition if they can, if they can keep their, uh, their heads, you know, together and, and not, let it, not let it get to the head. And I tell them both, man. I mean, I, I'll say it on video, I'll say it on camera, and I'll, I'll say it to them in their face that. The only reason they're not at the top of the, the division or they're not one of the top prospects is because you know, at times they, uh, they get lazy. You know, they, they have so much talent, they have so much talent, and they don't put in the hard work. You know, and I tell them to their face, I'm like, come on, man, let's, right. let's get with it. You know, when, push them, yeah, I push them. When they spar with me, they give it 100%. They look fabulous, you know, but when it's fight time, when the, the pressure's on them, right. they, they tend to fold, fold sometimes. And right. I tell them, if, if we can ever get these guys to really let their hands go and train, right. I mean, they're one of the top fighters in the division. Right. All right.